Hi guys, Kimberly Cherry here with a, another very quick cherry tutorial for you today. I'm going to be showing you how to remove the factory face off of a Monster High or similar fashion doll. I'm using Scudita today because I want to repaint her face and because she has all this wonderful markings on it. You're going to need three, possibly four things including your doll, some cotton balls, most importantly, 100% pure acetone, not nail polish remover, no, no, no. 100% pure acetone, and possibly, you may or may not need some Q-tips. I have everything here just in case, and we're just going to get right to it. Going to first get our cotton balls and our Q-tips mixed up. We're going to saturate the cotton ball very, very well. Then we're going to apply this straight to her face. Just like it is. Oh gosh, so this is gonna take some doing. I, I've taken off Monster High faces before, but it's been a while. And so, yeah, I'm just pressing down with a little bit of force and rubbing. And it looks to me like this girl is going to have some stains, which is always worth considering when you are trying to decide what type of design or what style you want your custom to be in. A lot of times you might have to paint over staining. A lot of toys will stain, especially vinyl toys. And we're just going to do the same thing over again. I'm going to saturate our cotton ball really, really well. And again, just go back to work here. And I don't think I'm going to need those Q-tips. I thought I might, but it doesn't look like I'm going to. Okay, that's all of it off except for in those creases, which, you know, depending upon what you're doing may or may not matter with your doll. Honestly, I don't have a, a good solid idea of what design I want this doll to have. I know she's going to have a Dia de los Muertos design, but that's like seriously the extent of my, my plans here. So I do want to go ahead just for the sake of simplicity and remove as much of this paint as I can. If for no other reason than the fact that I really seriously doubt I want a blue theme here. Blue is typically not in my color palette for my custom dolls. It is on occasions, but not typically. Not typically. And yeah, to get in these creases between her lips. If if you need to get it out, you may have to resort to a paintbrush. Yeah. Just because this stuff is seriously very resilient. And it don't want to come off. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, so that's clean enough for my purposes. That's what we've got. I hope this was helpful to you guys. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment box down below. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like, share, and subscribe for more cherry tutorials in the future. We will see you guys next time. 
Bye-bye. 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 B